Hi, my name is Phyllis Kinch. I'm the mother of Tom Sadowitz, and um, we've adopted Tom when he was eight years old. Now he's 41, and he's been uh, the apple of my eye, and he's my sunshine and the star. And um, I just love him to bits. And um, this is my husband, Frank, and um, he's, we've been married five years, so he's kind of been uh, brought into the game. We found this place, which is close, and we also gave him the option of moving to Bourbonnais, not with us, but near us, because we knew he had to be eventually on his own. So he chose to stay here. He has a personal support worker, which makes it very easy on us. Tom does a great job actually living on his own, um, however there are some times he does need a little bit help with making sure he stays on budget, um, sometimes he needs reminders, um, cleaning his house, he, he likes to have a companion, he likes to have somebody to talk to, um, so I try to come in and have like topics ready for us to discuss, like lots of debates, um, I take him out in the community too. I don't know, I just want people to know that I do have autism. But I don't get that, uh, let that get in the way of what I want to do. I don't let anything get in my way. Tom wants to act. He um, eats, sleeps, drinks, dreams constantly, as you can see by all his posters and inspirational plaques. And I would hope that his dream would come true. Um, I would like him to actually be able to possibly work with someone who he can who sees his drive and his ambition and how he can focus when he's in front of a camera. My dream is that someone will recognize in him that he can do it. I'm trying to get learn more about autism so I can help Tom more. I realized that when we married her that this was going to be a little challenging. That My biggest thing that I want for Tom is um, happiness, health, and safety. And um, I'm afraid that when I'm gone, there's not going to be someone there besides his personal support worker who gives him 15 hours a week to basically really worry about him. Um, I don't feel that there's anyone in the family that I could count on that much to um, help him with the day to day. I'm, I'm proud that he's doing as well as he is, and most people that I say, you know, my son is autistic and he's living on his own, they're like, what? you got to be kidding, and he drives, you know? But um, I think he's done really well. And uh, sometimes I wish, I, wish, I wish he was closer to us, just so that I could um, introduce him to the things that are out there that I feel, being in Bourbonnais, it's a smaller area, a uh, smaller county, there's more things that I, that I think more trusting things out there than there are here. So that's why sometimes I wish he was with, not with us, but by us. <laughs> so, but I think he's done a real good job and I'm proud of him.